Amazon and Sony are getting the kind of attention they don't want. There's a lot of development opportunities in the mobile game space and actually in the mobile space in general. I'm Mark Pfeffer and this is the Dice News Update for Tuesday, April 26, 2011. Amazon and Sony are having a bad week, and it's only Tuesday. Amazon's still recovering from the outage of its EC2 cloud computing service, and meantime, Sony's PlayStation network's been down since last Wednesday because of what it calls an external intrusion. VentureBeat says that Sony's problem is the worst outage ever suffered by a major online network. Now, besides these things being embarrassments to the company, not to mention the financial problems they're going to cause, they're also going to put cloud advocates in something of a bind. It used to be that you could point to the cloud's reliability as a reason to harness its power. Now, not so much. Skeptics now have some real weight to their argument that catastrophic failures can happen in the cloud as well as in their own data centers. Now, I know, by the way, for the record, that PSN isn't exactly a cloud service, but because it's online, I think it's going to be a part of the argument. So more consumers want to play social and mobile games. That's pressuring console developers. So Activision, Disney, and THQ have all had layoffs recently, and sales of the PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 have been kind of tepid this year. So, no surprise, companies are shifting their attention to mobile games. It's a lousy dynamic for console folks, but it's good news for those working in the social and mobile space. For example, Zynga. They produce the immensely popular Mafia Wars in Farmville, and they plan to double their 1,500-person workforce this year. Here's some more about mobile. Mobile app developers are in high demand right now. In fact, just trying to find them is becoming a bottleneck for companies that want to get into the mobile marketplace. The technologies are so new that there just aren't a lot of software engineers out there who've got mobile development experience. Also, small and medium-sized businesses are looking for mobile app specialists, including developers, security experts, and business analysts. And there's one more thing about smaller companies. The IT staffing firm Modus says that they're hiring more IT people across the board in general. That's it for this week. Cat Miller's back tomorrow with another edition of Dice TV, and I'm back next Tuesday. Until then, I'm Mark Pfeffer, the senior editor of Dice News, and we now return you to your regular desktop.